In today's video, I'm going to show you how to download and install Forge and Forge mods for any version of Minecraft on your Mac. Before we get started, it's important to note that you will need to have Java installed to your Mac. So if you don't have it already, I will leave that tutorial linked in the description below. The first thing we need to do is to download the Minecraft version files so we can install Forge and mods later. To do this, you want to open your Minecraft launcher, and in the version drop down menu, you want to select the version of Minecraft you want to install mods for. So for this example, it's 1.21.4. Once Minecraft has opened, this means the correct files have been downloaded, so you want to click on Quit Game, and now we can go ahead and download Forge. To download Forge, we first need to open our web browser, and you want to go to files.minecraftforge.net, and I'll leave this link in the description below. From here, you want to choose your Minecraft version from the left hand side menu, and for this example, we are going to choose 1.21.4. Once you've selected your Minecraft version, you want to click on the Installer button underneath Download Latest. And after 5 seconds, a skip button will appear in the top right, so you want to click on that. Then you want to go ahead and download the Forge installer to your Mac, and for this example, I'm going to download it to my desktop. Now, we just need to go ahead and download the Forge mods we want to use. So to do this, you want to open your web browser, and you want to go to a modding website of your choice, and for this example, I'm using modroof.com, which I'll leave in the description below. From here, you want to scroll down, and you want to click on Discover Mods, and then you want to go ahead and search for the mods you want to use. Now to make this easier, you can scroll down, and here in the left hand side menu, where it says Loader, you want to find where it says Forge. Now this has filtered all the mods by Forge, you can find them here. For this example though, I'm going to select Zero's minimap. Inside the mod page, you want to click on the versions tab at the top, and then you want to scroll down and you want to find the Minecraft version you want to install mods for. So for this example, it's going to be 1.21.4, and you want to make sure it's for the Forge platform. So once we're ready, we're going to click into that, and then you want to click on the green download button. And then you want to save the mod to your Mac. And again, I'm going to save it to my desktop. Now we've downloaded Forge and the Forge mods, we just need to go ahead and install Forge. So to do this, you want to open the Forge installer. And if you get this message, it means we need to approve it in the system settings. So to do this, you want to click on the Apple logo in the top left hand corner. And you want to click on system settings. Once you're inside your system settings, you want to scroll down. And you want to click on privacy and security. And again, you want to scroll all the way down until you find the Forge label, and you want to click on Open Anyway. You then want to click on Open Anyway, and then you may need to use your Mac password or Touch ID. After a few seconds, the Forge installer will open, and it will look like this. The process is simple, all we need to do is to make sure Install Client has been selected, and then you want to click on OK, and this will begin to install Forge to your Mac, and this may take a few seconds. However, mine was done pretty quickly, as I've installed it in the past, so I'm going to click on OK, and now go ahead and delete the Forge installer if you'd wish to do so. Now we've installed Forge, we just need to go ahead and install our Forge mods. So to do this you want to open your Minecraft launcher, and then you want to click on installations at the top, and you should see the Forge profile. If you don't see this, you may need to restart your Minecraft launcher. Once you've done this, you want to click on the file icon next to the Forge profile, and this will open your Minecraft installation folder. From here we just need to search for the mods folder, However, if we don't have one, you want to create a new one by clicking on the circle icon at the top, and then you want to click on New Folder. Now you want to rename it Mods. Once we've done this, you want to click into the Mods folder, and you simply want to drag and drop all of your Forge mods into this folder like this. Now we've done that, you want to exit out of the installation files, and now we want to play Minecraft with our Forge mods. So to do that, you want to click on the Play tab at the top, and then in the drop down menu, you want to select your Minecraft Forge version. Once you've done this, you want to click on Play. Once Minecraft opens, we know we've done this correctly because it will say Forge in the bottom left hand corner with the number of mods loaded. Now if you want to see a list of all of your mods, you want to click on the Mods button, and here you'll see them on the left hand side menu. If you want to configure them, you want to click on the mod itself, and then you want to click on Configure, and here you'll see all of the individual settings for that mod. Now to play Minecraft with our mods, we just want to go back, and we can start playing just as we normally would. And that's it, so if this video was helpful, please leave a like, and if you have any questions or comments, you can leave them below.